Okay, so as an amendment to um, what I was looking at in lesson and the video tutorials that would have been in the PowerPoint, which is online, we're just looking at issues with actually getting our landscape material onto an object. And the reason that we were having the issue is because Unreal 5 has got a new way of creating landscape. So you can create a landscape the old way where you just have a landscape. Um, if you start with the open world map, or start with certain maps, you sometimes get this, basically it's this world settings or this world partition settings. And all this allows you to do is to stream in different parts of a level at different times. So it's kind of caching them in chunks. If I was to try to just put my material on this, so if I just click on this landscape and then go in and just let's find our material. So this is the way we're doing it, which is with a normal landscape without our world partitions. Go in here, let's type in, so this is my landscape material, click on that, and it doesn't do anything. It retains the same landscape that was there before. And even though mine, if I go into landscape, it has the um, layers on it, we can't actually do anything with the layers, it won't allow me to go any further with this. So, easy, easy fix. What you just need to do is go into our landscape and we need to apply our material to every individual one of these. Now, luckily, what we can do is click on the top and just scroll down to the bottom of this. Shift click on the bottom to select everything. So it's just selecting all the parts of that. And now if I go in, you'll see that actually it's not got our material on it. It's got this, this uh, proc grid, this procedural grid that we had by default. Let's now go in and add our landscape material. Just give this a second. And there we go. I can see that it's working because the way it's blanked out. So if we now go to our landscape, we've got our materials, we've got our layers. Just need to click on the layer info. So let's click on this. So let's do a weight blended layer. I'm just going to save it in there. And now I can see that that has got my texture on it. Click on the next one, weight blended let, click save, let it do its thing. And the next one, weight blended let, let it do its thing. So now we have the functionality to be able to paint in our uh, layers, because I can go into here now, let's just say gravel. I can now paint in my gravel. Go to my grass, and I can now paint in my grass layer. So zoom in this a little bit, let me just take the camera, speed it down. See, I've got my different textures, different materials. Okay, so that's how to work with these landscape, uh, these world partitions. Just make sure that you select everything, all of these landscape streaming proxies, all the way down. Okay, that's that done.